4.32 a.m. or a philosopher wanders thinking. The city sleeps while I roam, the darkness for morning twilight, the cool, vacant darkness. Is this the feel of death's touch? My mind wanders as do my feet. A fox lopes, wary, crosses the hard man trail in the streetlight's glow. Spirits soar amongst the rising mist of morning fog, shrouded, cautious, aware of the coming day, yet unafraid. Perseid soars undaunted by earth, intercepting his celestial path. He drops off silent visitors in disregard of their destination. Sister Moon, waning, wears her beautiful cosmic crown, watching, alone, distanced, pulled by the sun yet clinging. Stoic Polaris observes it all, man's heavenly silent shepherd. Celestial gods look upon it all, quietly ruling as ever has been. The goddess inhales, calling spirits home. She sighs, exhales a cleansing fog, bemused by man's folly. She casually carries on. Twilight, humanity begins to awaken. An infant stirs within her dream. A toddler's nightmare brings a scream. A father rolls over, feigning sleep. Mother skulls, this guy's a creep. Sunrise, Venus, Venus exudes her blessed love. Mars feels mankind's hate. Saturn watches from far above. Mercury runs his endless race. Daybreak, a Catholic priest questions his faith. A pagan completes morning ritual. The homeless fuel fires with pages from a Bible. A Sikh in trance has levitated. The addicts wonder why they're hated. A Buddhist admires a lotus flower. A Baptist judges countenance sour. A Hindu smiles she has reached nirvana. All of this happened within an hour. An angry husband continues to curse his battered wife. Could this be worse? We couldn't save her, explains the nurse. A crying doctor calls for the hearse. A selfish Christian believes he's humble. A starving child's stomach grumbles. Broken society continues to crumble. A weary drunk longs to be numb. Complacency replaced compassion. To really care is not in fashion. Enlightened races watch from above, pondering why humans don't all practice love. Why don't we cease our misbehaviors or recognize we're our own saviors? For when we practice tender labors, we only need to love our neighbors. The philosopher thinks and wonders when mankind might find joy again to practice love, to become friends. This weary poet has reached the end. <laughs>